Hello guys, so today I'm gonna show you a small tutorial in how to save your username and password for the UWorld USMLE Q Bank. Cause I know it's a hustle every time you need to put your email ID and password. It's gonna be an easy tutorial and quick. I've uploaded a file that has all what you need and you can find the link in the description. So we need to install a small software. It's gonna be quick. It's called Utu Hotkey. Then just install the software, double click, and then click Express Installation. And that's it, installation complete. And then exit. Go back and open the second folder. You will see a file that has the code. Now go and right click on the file, and then choose Open with Notepad you will see the code that we need to edit. We need to change email to our email and we need to put our password. Okay, before proceeding, if you do not have the open with notepad, you need what you need to do is go to start and then type note. You will see the notepad app. If it opens, go to file and then open. And then go to the folder where we have the ready hot key. Go to, to the folder and then just click all so you see all files. You will see the hot key file. Open it and then you will see the code. Anyways, so here we put our email. Okay, let's say this is my email for the U world. Okay, you world username and password. So, and this is the password for my the you world. Okay. Then you click file and save. Now we've saved the credentials. Then what you need to do is you go to start again and then write run and then open run. Then just type this shell two dots startup and click OK. Now you will see the folder that has the files that run when you turn on your computer. So it's called the startup folder. What we need to do is just make a copy of this one, the script copy, and then paste it here. So every time you open your computer, the script will run. No need to put to run the script every time. Okay. So once we're done with this, because now we're not restarting our computer and this is the first time you run it. So you right click and run the script. Here it will say that there is an old script probably because I already have it saved. You might not get this one. Anyways, so just right click and save. Then you will see it down here. You will see it here. Okay, just forget it. So after running it, that's it. Once you restart your computer, there is no need to run this every time. Just make sure you do not delete this file, the one th that is in the startup folder. Just keep it there. Okay. So let's test the method now. If you go to your world and then you open it. Okay. So now what you need to do is you press alt and slash. That's it. You will see it. You will see your email and password and then it will sign in without even clicking signing in. Okay. It says wrong because that, this is not my real username and password. And that's it. Thank you very much.